All right, um, so we're going to set up a S120 uh, drive, uh, IP address, Profinet address, and the um, uh, Profinet name. So we open up Starter, and I have a project there, but you can start a new project, you can open an existing project, doesn't uh, matter uh, right at this stage, because we're just going to use a uh, find accessible node and setting the address uh, function so uh, the project doesn't matter now I'm going to go to accessible nodes it's going to do a scan uh, you may have to turn off uh, virus firewalls or something sometimes they block the scan um, and then it scans what's on the network uh, now I have this set for my uh, Ethernet card uh, it's got the name of the actual hardware card in my uh, setup here you make sure that you have your card selected so you can see there when you do the PG PC setup uh, that I have my actual card set up there uh, you may have stars defaulted to USB connection so make sure you change that to uh, Ethernet um, so I'm gonna tell it to do another scan just hit the update button all right anything that this can configure will have a little square uh, next to it the other stuff is just stuff on the network that it found but aren't drives that we can configure with uh, starter so all we gotta do is uh, to get to these functions is right click uh, one thing you can do is you can flash the uh, LED on the front especially if you've got a bunch of units you want to make sure that the one you just highlighted is the unit you're actually connected to uh, that you think you're connected to so you can flash the little LEDs next I'm going to change the IP now this is a drive already set up so it actually has an IP instead of having to 0000 in there um, but you normally just put in your IP, your subnet, uh, and uh, normally you're not going through a router. So then it will set the address. As long as the drive is not running or talking to a PLC already, it, it'll set. If it is, you'll get an error. It won't let you change the IP while it's running or uh, another processor is controlling it. Then you set the uh, Profinet name and that's all you gotta do uh, and it writes it right to the uh, ethernet chip inside the, the drive or profinet chip and your address is um, uh, set uh, you don't have to uh, do anything else uh, you can also uh, look at the diagnostic buffer directly uh, at this point so you just here's a buffer uh, I've never set the time or uh, date in the drive. <clears throat> drive really is just relative there anyhow. Yeah. So anyhow, good luck.